in case someone need it. Okay, so this one I will explain about how to set a camera for interior view. Okay, so let's say this one is your, your building. Make sure that your perspective is activated. Make sure that this one is dark. Then I'll use uh, the command called camera. And then actually it said, it'll ask you, do you want to show high toggle? I want, definitely want to show. So I type S and enter. Then actually you see that this one is actually, this one shows the camera information on the perspective. Okay, so here, this point is actually the camera point. Just select it, just kind of move it as if you move any point. So I just, what I do, I just kind of drag it to somewhere inside your camera. Then what you have to do is here in the perspective, you see that perspective is changed. So as you see that this one is actually changing uh, camera point, you probably want to change other, I would change this one, I just change, select these two points, and also using shift button and this one, I would actually, uh, actually I want to select this one, I want to move it down, and also select again, and then I will move it to somewhere in the building, and then you see that you are in the building actually now. And actually, from now on, I would rather just use ball, uh, you know, just eyeball it to find the right angle. And then, but for your interior view, you need a wider angle, actually smaller angle camera to change that. Go to prospect, uh, this, click this uh, arrow triangle button. Go to viewport properties. Then actually, you can change your camera lens here. I would rather use smaller one for interior view. So now you have more wide angle. So actually, this is the first question. Insert. Always, I always kind of like save this. So go to viewport. Okay, go to set view, named view. Make sure that you save this one by clicking save as. So by doing this, so this one is my view 01. So now next time, even if you change it, you can go back to your previous saved view anytime. So this one is a right location.